How's it going everyone? It's Abdallah here with another exciting tips and tricks video for Fire Emblem Echoes on Nintendo 3DS. Today's tutorial is all about how to overclass your Falcon Knight with the help of the DLC map called Altar of the Sky Lord. So if you guys are excited for it, definitely smash that like button, share the video with a friend. Let's go. So what's overclassing, Abdallah? This is the first time I've seen any of your videos about overclassing. Well, it's where you take your unit that has been the very top most of their promotions, uh, i.e. villager to, I don't know, what is that, like, falcon, what is that, uh, pegasus knight into falcon knight, so third tier, and then you max them out at level 20. So, case in point, we got Faye right over here. Faye is looking good. Okay, so Faye's at level 20. And when the AXP shows that there's like a dash in it, that means that you can't gain anymore. You're pretty much done with your unit as they are. So whatever random level ups you got in the game, without the help of your star adjacents, that's what you got and you're stuck with it. But with, with overclassing, you can get another 20 levels to help boost their stats even further. And that's great, especially for a character like Faye where some of her stats are still in the single, single digits. That's going to be good for her. So anyway, I'm excited to find out what kind of class we're going to get with the help of the Altar of the Skylord. So let's just jump on in. We're going to go over to Manage DLC. If you guys have not purchased the DLC, please do so. You guys will have access to this awesomeness. Uh, we're going to go over here, Altar of the Skylord. Looking cool, right? Skylords? Never heard of it. But uh, only in this game, right? Man, I wish a lot of other Fire Emblem games would adopt this kind of uh, overclassing. It would make the game a lot more fun. Anyway, here goes Hermit again. So, uh, here lies a forgotten altar left behind by one of the gods of yore. After the ancient folk chased them from this world in ages long past, altars such as this grant the power to overclass to transcend mortal limits. This one's called the Altar of the Sky Lord. Once a goddess of war soared like the wind across the battlefield, inspiring a legion of warriors with her lance and magic. Oh, that's great. Only those who walk the path of the Falcon Knight may receive her boon. If there are those among you that the altar deem worthy, then venture forth and offer your prayers as God of yore. I think we're going to do it. So, Faye. Uh, we made Faye. Faye was one of the units at the very beginning of the game where you can choose many different routes for her. Knowing that I played through Gaiden and one of the most effective units in the game were the Falcon Knights, I definitely made Faye a Falcon Knight or a Pegasus Knight at the time. So we're absolutely going to do that. Uh, we got Faye, but yeah, we got Faye and uh, Claire. So let's go. Pegasus Knights, Falcon Knights, they're very good in this game. Uh, not only do they have the added ability to do super effective damage on terrors, but if you're facing up against a, an archer without a specific bow that has anti-flyers attached to it, you're not going to take the super effective damage in this game. Anyway, let's examine this thing. Here's an idol. Uh, check that bird out. I've never seen anything like it before. All right, that's kind of cool. So anyway, here we go. Faye, let's do this. So she's going to become a Harrier. Uh, the path of a Falcon Knight who has achieved mastery. All right, the Harrier class, something brand new to Fire Emblem. I'm pretty excited for it. Are you watching, Alm? <laughs> oh, Faye. Still not an archer. What the heck? Whoa, look at that outfit. Dang, Faye, what are you wearing, girlfriend? I can to keep you safe, Alm. Oh my gosh, what are you and what kind of Pegasus is this? This is a flying horse that's all purple with a orange mane. And oh my gosh, that outfit. Whoa. <laughs> oh man, too bad this game is not HD. That would be really cool. Anyway. So yeah, whoa, that's great. Faye learns fire now. I wonder if Faye's going to learn anything else. I mean, she's already got Gradivus because that'll help out with a 1 to 2 range, which does exactly what fire does. Uh, but now in this game, there's no uh, special attack skill or magic attack skill in this game. So your magic attack is whatever your attack is. So now that we can do fire, that'll also attack people towards their resistance. In case we come across an armored unit, uh, now we can totally burn them. But... Just when you thought we were done, oh, no, we're not. Hey, hey, Claire! What, my personal favorite out of the Pegasus on Alm's side is definitely Claire. Definitely Claire. Let's go. Let's go, Claire. This is cool. I do like the Harrier class. It looks amazing. Uh, I love the outfit on the ladies. I love the way that the, the horse is just weird looking. Best class so far. Look at this. Oh, man. That's crazy. 
If this is the life the mother would have me lead. Yeah, absolutely. I totally agree with the mother on that one. That's, oh man, good job. All right, cool, right? That's the best class so far. You get, uh, you're still a flyer with the same movement, but you have the ability to use fire now. That's cool. Are you going to be able to learn Thunder or Sagitte or anything like that? I don't know, but only time will tell. So yeah, that's going to be it for the episode. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you guys think. Is that cool? Is it yay, nay? Are you guys going to get the DLC just so you can uh, have your Pegasus Knights as these Harriers? I would suggest it, man. If you guys want to see them in action, definitely pay attention to my Let's Play. We're doing a 100% walk through the game. So check that out right over here. And of course, you guys can indeed continue watching the DLC playlist where we do a bunch of other DLC um, and tips and tricks. Newest video on the channel there, and of course, some recommendations there. Hit that subscribe button, and uh, yeah, make sure that you guys are all subscribed. Turn your notifications on. We're going to continue on. There are not too many of these left. Uh, we're going to do all of them uh, all in due time, so stay tuned. So thanks for watching. I'll talk to you in the next one.